replace your dog. What's up, guys? My name is Damon Sparks, and welcome to the wing. <laughs> I forgot it was called. <laughs> In case you guys don't know, I made up this thing called the Wing Year Challenge, and basically, I asked you guys to give me some suggestions to of topics to write some songs about, and then I filmed myself writing the song just on the spot. You know, I just winged it, and I made a little song about some stuff that you guys told me to write a song about, and I thought it was fun. So anyway, I'm gonna take these suggestions that you guys have so graciously donated to me, and I'm gonna transform them into a song. I can't promise that the song will be good. I can't promise the words will be all that poetic, but. You know, it, it's gonna be fun still, I hope. Alien Jennifer suggests I should write a song about wearing flannels in summer, which I was actually doing today. Very hot, I think it was like 38 degrees. I don't know how to translate Celsius and Fahrenheit, but it was, it was hot. That's what I'm saying, it was hot. And I was wearing a flanny because style is greater than comfort. Let's just roll with that. All right, all right, all right, all right, here we go. Style's more important than comfort. I'd rather sweat all day than live by What if I see a friend while I'm at the shops Then I really don't want to look back That's why I'm wearing a fanny in summer Yeah, a fanny in summer It's even worse if I don't really know the person Or maybe we're friends on Facebook but haven't talked Survive social interactions. <laughs> Alright, you can buy my hit single, uh, Flanny in Summer, <laughs> on SoundCloud. <laughs> I'm actually pretty proud of that. Is that bad? <laughs> Victoria's asked me to write a song about her addiction to chocolates. <sighs> Relatable! Victoria really likes to eat chocolate. Victoria says that she has an addiction. pretty good for a little bit and then it just went downhill. <laughs> Caro has asked me to write a song about avocados. My favorite veg fruit. Ve <laughs> avocados are the number one reason the millennials can't afford housing in 2017 and it's just gonna be the exact same thing in 2018. If not worse, avocados are the number one reason the millennials are ruining the planet. It's causing deforestation, it's causing people to have no more money because avocados are so expensive and millennials have to have it on their subway. <laughs> Next song! <laughs> Anna Martinez has asked me to write a song about Dan and Phil, and I think that's a great idea. So I'm gonna try. Um, I feel like I should go for like. Alright, I got it, I got it. Phil has a soul that is so happy. If he was a color, he probably would be blue, or green, or yellow, or white, and everything else that is so bright. He's such a pleasure to be around, probably. I don't understand how he's friends with someone like Daniel How. And his existential crisis is, yeah, Daniel How. Probably wearing Kanye's clothes again, yeah, Daniel How. Uh, no, 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 you used to like llamas a lot, Daniel How. You used to really like presenters for some reason, but back. Chirpy watching his videos makes me so happy I wonder what he's doing He's probably drawing or maybe Selling some of that cereal Na 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 I really like Phil but also Daniel How Like Phil but written I don't know Daniel How He used to be in my but now he's not Daniel How My emo inspiration in 2009 that was kind of clever. Break Like Strings has asked me to write a song about my favorite hoodie. My favorite hoodie! I haven't been able to wear it for a long time because it's very hot. So I'm gonna write a separation song. This sounds pretty sweet. Wait, no, I'm sad, I'm sad. <laughs> my hoodie! 
hoodie is gone. Can't wear my hoodie because I live in Australia. So it's summer every day. If I have a barbecue, I can't wear my hoodie. If I go outside, I can't wear my hoodie. Even though it looks really cool. No matter what, I can't wear my hoodie. Savannah R has asked cereal or fringe and I can only assume you mean would I prefer like a bowl of cereal or would I prefer my fringe like my hair so are you asked me to write a song about like which one I prefer to have if I can only have one I'm really sorry if I'm misinterpreting your suggestion but that's, I'm gonna write a song about that now if that's okay with you I woke up and a teeny told me I can only have my hair or breakfast treats So I had to choose quickly And I chose Hair for cereal That was the worst thing I've ever made in my life And I hate myself Victoria has asked me to write a song about food Finally, something I'm incredibly passionate about I eat if I'm happy I eat when I'm sad I eat when I'm bored and I would eat my hands Cause my best friend is always there for me Yeah, it's food I really love food That's the song that I'm gonna call The Dangers of Food Addiction Write about your favourite light on your new fairy lights Like your favourite light bulb on them Oh, that's so sweet You're really bright, I guess But no brighter than the rest I don't Favorites, but if I had to, I would pick you. I would pick you, but I'm not sure why. Wait, this song's only about one, not the whole thing. There's lots of you in here. I don't want the rest of here, but you're the best one of them all. You know, I think that's literally 1,200. In this room. I'm sorry to all my fairy lights. I feel kind of bad. <laughs> Lobster Lou has asked me to write a song about when people dog ear book pages to keep their place. I feel like I'm not understanding what this means. So I'm going to complete the sentence. When people's dogs eat book pages to keep their place in the family. So what's happened is the dog has eaten a page of like a dog pamphlet booklet for like a dog shop so that the family doesn't get a new dog and replace this dog because that's wrong you shouldn't replace your dog a dog is not an object a dog is a friend and you should treat it like a friend you should treat it like you would treat like a human being okay a dog is good and you should love your dog and not replace them okay i'm gonna write a song about not replacing your dog because i really love dogs and i really hate people who don't appreciate their dogs okay here's a song for every dog out there if you're a dog listening to this you can download for free on iTunes, okay? You have my permission. Don't replace your dog. Just love the one you've got already. Don't replace your dog. It's your friend. It's your family. Don't replace your dog. It's the best friend for life. Don't replace your dog. Just get another one at the worst. Case scenario, don't replace your dog. Oh. I think that's genuinely the most passionate I've been in this video about a topic. Okay, ah. wow. Emma's Adventures has asked me to write a song about the perfect day ever. The perfect day ever. All right, today I ate some food. One, why school sucks. I actually kind of really liked school, but that was because like I had some really cool teachers who were actually genuinely helpful and some really cool friends. Uh, they were like bullies and they were, you know, bad friends, fake friends or whatever. My bully comes up and knocks me to the ground. My teacher calls me dumb and says I'll never amount. Things that I want and me 
be the right When they make me feel small with all their mental fights I can't keep this going, I need it to stop But what can I do when my teachers won't stand up? Now I feel so tired and I feel so weak It's only Monday, I've got Easter about the rest of the week My favorite class becomes a battleground I've been a war I never signed up for I'm not a soldier, I'm just a student Why do all these classes feel like I'm sinking? My voice is gone. I'm pretty happy with the songs that I wrote in this video, and I really hope you like them. Uh, you can download them all on Bandcamp and SoundCloud and iTunes, and download on Spotify. Is that how Spotify works? Download on Google Drive and um, the Pirate Bay. <laughs> Thanks so much for giving me the suggestions to write these songs. I had so much fun. I really like making these videos. I'm definitely gonna make this video again at some point. So if you want to leave your suggestions for song song topics for the next time I film this, in the comments below then that would be fantastic. I love getting you guys involved in these videos. It's so much fun. Thanks so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it because I sure did. Leave your suggestions for the next video in the comments. If there's a cover you want to see me play or if there's a matchup you want to see me make or just another video you want to see me make, let me know in the comments below because I read them all, I see them all. It's like a sea and I'm swimming in it. I'm all up in it, baby. I really hope you like the songs that I wrote and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Nice.